Hey, what's up guys? It's Geordie Bar 22 here and welcome. The Battlefield 1 beta has now come and gone. Yes, I've been amped for this game for the last half year. Um, so this means Geordie Pressions. If, if you like that name, please, you know, comment that name in the comments. Just tell me if you like it or not. But that's why I'll be calling this segment until someone tells me how lame it is. So Geordie Pressions it is for now. I'm still working on the name. The beta was awesome. I can give you that. Uh, enjoyed all the new vehicles. Didn't like the land ships though. The the land ships were kind of off for me. They didn't have the greatest loadouts, so that's why I didn't like them. So people just kept on going behind me and and throwing anti tank grenades, and I was like, oh, anti tank grenades, anti tank grenades are a biatch. Mm, the horses were great. The best horses I've ridden since Red Dead Redemption, and cheers to dice for that. There's great, uh, even the witch's horse wasn't that great. <laughs> so that was really cool, except for when you lagged, then your horse would suddenly become flash and go doo -doo 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 down, the, down, down the map. And yeah, that's that was it, basically. Uh, sorry, the footage, by the way, is from a really, really, really crap game uh, that I played. It isn't the greatest footage. It's one of the best ones that I recovered from Xbox Live, though. It was one of my first three games, so, you, you know, it was great. But here's my four favorite classes. Uh, the Scout class. I use this the most. That's number one. Um, a bullet drop's not as bad as people say. And by the way, here is some great South African lag for you. Um, the scout class is really good. It just didn't have as much bullet drop as people said it did. It was it was still a great class. It's what I used the most, and I got quite a few kills with it. Uh, second, the meta class. The meta class was great. Just the only factor that I hated about it was I had to spam bullets into people. It felt like I was playing the division for a while. It felt like I was using a pistol. So like. It was like da 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 da, and then they just went down. They just went down. But I, I still enjoyed it. I got quite a few kills with it later. I wrecked with it. Uh, the support class is my third favorite class uh, because of how accurate it was, but only after time. It was more of a realistic gun set, if you ask me. It only got accurate after maybe like like five or six seconds of shooting it. But it was really good. And then fourth and final, I didn't play as this class very much. And I know everyone's like, oh, assault, assault, assault. Uh, I didn't really get it in this. It wasn't that great to me. And it took me a while to kill people. I don't know why. Apparently the assault's supposed to be fast. It just took a while to kill people. Um, and here's my last issue that I had with the beta. The servers, I had a serious issue with the servers. I recently upgraded my line during the beta and it just didn't fix the lag. The lag was still terrible. I got a 4 meg line. Um, sure thing, I'm in South Africa, but there's no African servers at the moment. I think there might be because there was a filter for it in the servers list. So I'm sure there will be in the full game release. Uh, plus I was playing on Xbox, they don't have the greatest servers for Battlefield as far as I know and I'm sure it will get better by release. But thank you very much guys for listening, uh, please go like, share and subscribe this video and thanks for watching. Cheers cheers. Oh and by the way guys, on September 27th or just after that weekend of September 27th, me and my best friend Ethan McDonald are going to be doing a review on Forza Horizon 3, so stay tuned for that. Thanks a lot guys, enjoy your day.